A man on the mission all the way back in 1865, making a lasting impact on today's wine industry. The Springfield Discovery Center's new exhibit focuses on Herman Jaeger, a Swiss immigrant that came to the U.S. in 1864 and owned a vineyard in Neosho, Missouri, a year later. Jaeger created over 100 varieties of grapes, experimenting with different wild grapes found in the Ozarks. In the 1870s, European grapes started dying off due to phylloxera bugs eating the roots. They're usually native to the Midwest U.S. until they showed up in Europe due to the trade. Jaeger's solution paved the way for a thriving industry. Still to this day, you can find Jaeger's impact in vineyards across the world. They went around the Ozarks collecting what they thought would be resistant to this pest and also root well um, to send over to Europe so that people could graft their grapevines in their existing vineyards onto a rootstock that would not get demolished by this bug. The Herman Jaeger display had previously been a traveling piece since 2011, but is now a permanent fixture at the Discovery Center.